Hello everyone, this, this is Steve, the Instant Touch Tone. Today we will be talking about some piston doors and using these double piston extender circuits behind me to construct our doors. There will be <coughs> basically a description about uh, the tutorials of how to build these piston extenders. Uh, first thing we need to know is about the double piston extender which is which we will be mainly used in this door. Yes, this is the main this is the circuit behind the double piston extender it explains these are pistons and all we need is two bits of uh, four bits of clutch strong two repeaters and two stick pistons that we use clutch strong and input to the extents then the two clutches this second principle behind this door will be the ability of uh, Having lock and some locks to not to do not to stick to the one another, uh, which is locked by Minecraft. Most of the minute. Here we go. As we can see, these honey lockers, the stone locks are not connecting to be bound uh, with one another. There is something that I prepared earlier. Oh, maybe I feel that they too close. So the piston, the door behind me, uh, let me open it. Oh, here we go. The door behind me. No. <laughs> Is the implement? Lie, lie. Seriously. The door behind me, the door right here is a implementation of uh, the double uh, two by two piston extender as we can see there is one double piston extender here and one double piston extender right here or else when we activate the pressure, pressure plate they go four blocks two blocks uh, two pairs of blocks go in different directions pretty cool huh here we go there we go pretty simple this uh, circuit this behind us is very simple. There is RF shield on it, it is taking the input from pressure plate and this lever and uh, turning off these uh, piston torches which are keeping these pistons extended. Let me show you how it works from behind as well. And here we go. As we can see, the door is closed right now. I will click the lever, and once again, when I click the lever, it opens. This is, this is a very simple implementation of this double piston extender circuit. Let's disconnect this double stream. Hello. Now there is, its footprint is a bit bigger than the usual double two by two piston piston doors, but I did the YouTube thing. Something I prepared earlier. Oh, it has to close. <laughs> Just look at that chin. Damn! Damn! Oh, sorry, I mean that. That was cringe. So, this is a 3 by 3 implementation of a double connection to the circuit. It's very simple. You can straight up the door. As you can see, the door reflects uh, these four going to the right wall and these five going to the left wall. Let me show you from the high height parts. There, there is once again the honey block sign that logic is used. Four, uh, four blocks are screwed into these in five of these. Now we cannot extend from this door concentration higher more than five blocks because the piston piston push limit in the Minecraft. And yes, we can do it for the do it with the help of mods by the uh, by by making uh, the piston push limit be more more. Let me show you how. Not currently, I'm in the window. 
This door is also very simple. Then we have this, uh, this restaurant line, this special extension, and this as well, and the closing door. So, yes, this is one of the easiest three three piston doors ever. Guaranteed. We have this one for footprints. Sorry about that. I say there are these many small doors, uh, doors with small footprint than this, but they won't be easy. There will be like, uh, many bits and bobs, like one might have a silver three, stone door, like a one by one by five, I guess one by five or one by four, one by four, which are one by five or one by four to something, so you can't cut it, it's very difficult. Then there is this very simple door with a bit of a big footprint. We need about three by, three by four space for each module of this television channels. Let me show you another example of the piston door. Here we go. This is another example of the piston door using the double piston extender circuits. As we can see, there is a bit of weird gibberish going on over here, which is very confusing. Let me explain what it does. So this is lagging behind this third example of the double piston extender door. This is a double piston extender circuit that number gender. There is the log link will be in the description. And this is what it does. This is how it works. There, uh, there is also a dust around here, then a block which takes power from this and transmitters to this uh, uh, soft pulse, this uh, uh, repeater which in turn powers this block and uh, this restaurant takes output from this block and transmitted to the, this piston. And then we have there is a restaurant right here taking the power from um, this uh, is quasi connectivity, which I do not understand at all, but somehow it works. It takes version input, and there is some weird, uh, there is some weird thing, uh, shenanigans, shenanigans going on with these torches and those things. This is then I think I'm going to can explain better than me. So this is the circuit I have used in the. Up in the final example of the double pitch next time the door. Back at the door. This is a four by four by four double pitch next time the door. And it is the coolest thing I have ever built. Like ever. For freaking ever. And I am a very dumb speed. Remember that. I do not know how things work. Moving on, this is the piston extender door and circuit will have might be complex, but there, there will be soon there will be a video in the future with the tutorial on making this door. The the circuitry behind it might be uh, confusing to you at once, but it is very simple. Let me show you. We should the lever and we should the lever and there we go. It opens. Close. Open. Close. So what the, what this lever is doing is that it is turning this redstone torch. This is this is the main power behind power source behind all of this circuitry. Circuitry. This redstone torch keeps all the circuitry alive. The power from this action top can uh, keep this double piston extender on these at uh, the up on and this one is as well. 
what to do is when this is the lever popping it out is that we turn up this uh, this was from past and everything retracts we go again once again sorry about the noise and the background it, it is very busy in the screen today so here it is yeah and yes we, we can also play with the timing a bit for example let me change this timing to 2 tick and this time to 8 tick what this will do is that uh, it will take out the indiv each individual segment of the door one by one for example this uh, these four blocks right here these four blocks right here will go towards the right these eight blocks right here we will go in the side uh, to the ceiling in the, at the second step and these four these four blocks will be go will be going in the left wall in the third step here we go and once again here we go and once again so this that was double to piston extend the doors and still doing jet code i will subscribe to the channel for more upcoming videos i also play many different games and i'll see you in the next one